Arin Helmstedt. Hi there and a warm welcome from our studios in Berlin and we are ready to go with another brand new week and living a little bit dangerously while we're at it. And we're kicking off with a brand new series, one in which extreme athletes test fate, quite literally, every day, be it in the water, in the mountains or in the air. This past weekend saw the aerobatic world championships taking place not far from Berlin. Now that's a highly dangerous sport with more than its share of fatal accidents. Loops, rolls, spins and tail slides are just some of their stomach jarring maneuvers in an airplane it should be noted, and Nicolas Ivanov of France made sure that he was in the mix. Ah, oh, thank goodness we can take a deep breath now. And although very few of us, of course, can compete with the likes of Nicolas Ivanov, we would still like you to send us your mo most impressive sport photos. So send them in to us. Just check out our website for all the details on what to do. And as a thank you, the sender of the best photograph will get a tidy little digital camera to continue their photographic career. And now for a slight variation on the theme of faster, higher, stronger, here comes our Express. Well, many will remember her fondly as that chronically frustrated single woman, always just a little bit overwhelmed by her chaotic lifestyle in the jungle that is London. She has a great talent for getting herself into endless messes, and that's yet another reason that we find Bridget Jones so utterly adorable. Well, after two blockbuster films, a third installment just had its world premiere in London 12 years Amazing, after the bumbling British heroine first made us howl with laughter. Well, that'll be lots of fun. Well, the view from here makes it only too credible. Berlin is one of the coolest cities on the planet, and for many, it is top of their to-do list. Tens of thousands of people move to the German capital every year, and this year, one of them happens to be Gero Schlies. Now, as a special correspondent for DW Culture, he left his assignment in the US to come to Berlin just this past spring. And his new online column, Berlin 24-7, tells about his experiences here as a newbie in the city and as a bit of a warm-up, we spent a day with them in the capital, just outside. And very soon, Gero Schlies will meet up with Berlin's most famous orchestra. That's, of course, the Berlin Philharmonic. That much I can give away. And, of course, his column will appear every Sunday in German and in English. So do check it out on dw.com slash culture. Well, now it is time for a Euromax Extra Tour. And Maria Catalina Zupaga de Lucher from All in the Space of a day. That's for sure. Well, from landscapes that are as dreamy as a painting, we go to films that look as if they were the work of a modernist master, whether cubist, impressionist, or even expressionist. The Trick is a special program created by computer science major Manuel Ruder of Freiburg in southern Germany. And for his final project, he decided he needed just a bit more artistic license. A terrific idea. Maybe we can even use it one day for an impressionist-themed program. Imagine that. Well, that brings us to the end of this edition of Euromax. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you missed anything, then don't forget that you'll find it all on our website. Until next time, alles Gute von uns hier in Berlin. Thanks for watching. Tschüss.